Hello Wild Buns! I'm here in the woods today on what will hopefully be a really beautiful autumn hammock camp. So I've got a DD Superlight hammock today and I've got a little foldable fire pit. So I'm hoping I'm going to get to make some gorgeous lamb steaks cooked on some coals. Let's find somewhere. down so I'm gonna try and put my hammock between these two trees behind. This one comes with these whoopee things go around the tree and they're supposed to be kinder to the tree and make it easier to sort of set it up properly. Let's see. tightens it, makes it higher and then we can loosen it by doing that and then when you got it where you want it just put that bead there next job is to put a ridge line up so these here they're the spreader poles and they are going to go in the bug net to like hold it out that are knowledgeable about hammocks can tell me what I've done wrong. <laughs> I don't know, I think it's okay. So, got a little tarp down to put my stuff on. The little pillows going in. The animals are making noises, so I wonder if we'll be able to see some eyes. Look, over there. Eyes. Hello. It's so funny, like, you are being watched, you feel like you're alone, but you're really not. I've seen three lots of head torches. I think I'm going to have to wait till it's a bit later before I start my fire. So I think next I'm going to go get lots of wood for my fire. I don't feel it's going to rain tonight, so I'm going to leave my tarp off because I just love being out in the air and seeing the sky and the trees so if it does start raining I have got the top so I can just whip it over the ridge line. Right, woods. That's the dog. Doggy? Hello? Hi! Oh my god. It's okay. <laughs> Guess me belongs to those people over there. Right, I'm going to keep lights off for a bit, Let's see what happens. This is my little fire pit. I'm really excited to try this. I love it. So that'll keep my little fire perfectly off the ground. I've cleared a little space here as well. So there's no sort of dry leaves and whatnot underneath. So I've got some wood. I've got some wood that I bought from home as well. Some dry grass, some natural fire lighters, some coal two lamb chops and some seasoning that salt pepper garlic and rosemary god well excited i'm hoping now it's about 20 to 9 that people won't be walking around anymore Ooh. 
got a fire. Yay. How cozy is this? Mason bushcraft knife today. She is a beautiful knife. Ah, they're gorgeous. Thank you, Mason bushcraft knives. Oh my god, that's a sharp knife. Yeah, I mean, that is just beautiful. That is so good. I kind of, I can't bear it how good it is. <laughs> When I go to bed, in case it rains, I'm just going to cover my stuff with the top. So, I just put it over like that, and then peg it like that. It's all covered. Night, wild ones. Morning. I love being in here. Oh, it's so lovely. Just lay here looking around. We've got about six hours sleep again, which is good. Yay. got to get going things to do that was a really nice night i was so cozy in the hammock with the under quilts i didn't use a match the under quilt and my rab 900 and that was just gorgeous really nice got about six hours sleep which is really good for me for world camping yeah really lovely so i've got for my next trip hopefully we'll be in the mountains on the first night of that i'm going to try camping in my car some of you might have seen on my instagram that i've converted my land rover freelander into a bed at the back so i'm really excited to try that as for the mountain trip weather looks awful we'll see what happens so yes stay tuned next time i will see you for a car camp and have a great day thanks for watching bye <laughs>
nature and you like this t-shirt, make sure you check out the link in the description. Bye!